The human body gets rid of alcohol in a predictable manner. It's called elimination. The taking in of alcohol is called absorption. Many studies have been done on alcohol absorption and elimination. One of the things you need to know, though, is that alcohol, when you first drink it, doesn't immediately get in your bloodstream. If you've eaten a large meal ahead of time, particularly if you've eaten a meal with high protein and some carbs, it will slow down the peak alcohol level quite a bit. We need to know what you've done that day, where you've been, what you've eaten, because we're going to do a calculation on a very sophisticated program that we paid for that will tell us where your alcohol level should be. In light of the fact that almost all of our tests are on a breath machine, which we've already told you about its reliability, we want to know if the machine is off and with witnesses we may be able to prove that your reading is far too high for some medical explainable reason and it goes against the actual science of where your number should be. We do this all the time by using a PhD pharmacologist, someone who teaches pharmacology and can explain it to a jury. It's called the disconnect. How could you be at such a high number and look good on video and yet the machine be saying that you're twice what you really should be on your chart?